Hi, dear Abdit, my money now cover. Says I want to subscribe here, and I'm promoting as well. Ben is a man, so I'm also being a all the daily Abdit. Eh, cause we're gonna find any now, so I don't want to be here. So ready, you're feeling in chimney and can't do one chimney. So ready, a year NDC national, a year chairman, a bar wanting a city get here. I be can send be brave because in Chibia and a John Dramani Mahama. And then I know Pukwajima Ebe can say, or more of my real gun I seek, or more the beba. Or be be a gun I seek, or could you know why any emra quines on illegal no quine be a som the says can beba. Selling the tells of a bunch of a cassa, Sankor for no scum of funny in an or mefiaba, or be an obit medinity, or momun in na befiaba, because say, or my yenisa, and for pound on quajiska, a dear boy mino, because he can you. Sikani ni na kudi di omo botom. Inti soma amfamu na si from even kwa Ghana for e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e Says canning in our coin, Modico election. I may see can a basso so are Mosiaba. Now so you will be a scan before because scan a bank or sink at least. Can who changes be? Booms interest rates. You see, I come on. Petro boss, what take a crack as you wish. Nay, never bore an echo so a heading. So I may see can a cramp away. A year a syndicate here as sugar enough for some veggies. Says canning in a syndicate here. Eddie and Brenner Cassa come home in quitting small job. Because you have been saying some things about uh, ensuring that money that is looted by appointees of this government, that you, you should be ready to cough it up. Uh, is this because I have heard this from even the general secretary of the party, the the, the flag bearer of the party, the call, even the running mate when she delivered her address, accountability that you ensure that everything that is done over this period is accounted for is there a reason behind the choice of that particular message oh we are a party of accountability that is what sets us one of the things that sets us apart from uh, the other parties because our core value is accountability not even accountability about financial resources alone accountability for power. If you are given power, you have been given some resource to work with, and you must hold yourself accountable to the people who entrusted the power into your hands. That is a core principle based upon which NDC was founded. And so it is not a new thing. Accountability will continue to be one of our guiding uh, principles. And as we talk about accountability, it's not accountability only from the opposite side. It's holding every Ghanaian accountable for whatever common resource that is entrusted in your hands. That is how you can live in a society that will continue to progress. The moment individuals within society can do things and declare themselves not accountable to anybody, that is the beginning of their rock in that society. And so accountability is key to running a progressive and prosperous society. And you know, that we have never been to work about how the resources of this country have been looted. Those that are done in broad daylight and that those that are done uh, <laughs> And so nobody can explain why this country will be in this dire state. Without talking about the question of accountability. Because you look at our revenue streams over the past 
close to eight years. And compare it with the development that has happened in the country. You find a huge gap, and that gap must be accounted for. And then when you look at uh, the fact that we have been declared as a bankrupt nation, which is unable to pay its obligations, that increases the need for trying to find out what went wrong. Because if you don't know what went wrong, you are bound to repeat what went wrong. So we have to find out what went wrong and guide ourselves as to how not to repeat what went wrong and do things better so we can uh, lift it and then put it on the path of progress. So accountability is very, very important, and we keep saying it. And that said, I am one of the people who believe that the wrong way to hold people accountable, wrongdoers accountable, is to paint all of them with the same brush. Nobody can convince me that there will be a government where every member in the government is a corrupt person. It won't happen. The same way, you cannot have a system where 100% every duty bearer is clean. So my problem with the approach of Nana Sifado in government is his persistent claim that all his people are clean. And even when there is glaring evidence, he will do everything to sweep it under the carpet. You know what it does to the country? Even the, the good ones within that group will begin learning how to do bad things. Take yourself as a minister, and me, me too, maybe as a minister in a hypothetical government. If I decide to conduct my affairs very responsibly and then accounting for everything that, that I, I, I have used my power for, every resource that has been put in my hands, I use it for the right purposes to make sure that I stay clean. And you, in the same government, convert public property to private property. Everything that comes your way, you use it for your, yourself and your family members. And then keep some for uh, bad things in future. And then we all get out of government. Maybe our party loses and we are out of government. You will go there with a lot of loot, property, cash, tax, somewhere, an investment that will be income for you for the next few days. Then I walk out of government and then have to go back and be struggling for my daily meal. Now when the day of accountability comes, and we say all of us are thieves, next time, when your son gets the opportunity to be in government, or my son gets the opportunity to be in government, there's only one thing we will do. Lose as much as possible because at the end of the day, they will treat all the past losers and non losers equally. So there is no incentive to be honest. So I don't like a system where everybody will be granted a thief. As I think to you that 
the general impression that if the NATO NPP government is corrupt. But I'm very, very confident that they are honest and diligent ministers or government appointees who are doing their work very well. So in the event they lose power and you begin putting all people who did their work well and they feed together and say they are all people. Then the person who did honest work will sit down and ask himself, did I behave wisely? Because if you go to the Nigerian society, your family people will be insulting you. You have been in power for eight years. Now you are asking for, for food. So society will not reward your honesty. Society will not reward your accountability. So we must begin as a country to identify people who live honest life in government and leadership and reward them. Whether they are in our party or not in our party. So that it serves as encouragement for the youth to know that it says to be honest. It says to be truthful. It says to be accountable. If we don't do those things, and always when there's a change in government, we bundle the other people and the looters together and say, because they were in this particular government, they are all free. And we are going to be in trouble. We will not be able to, 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 to fight corruption. And I think, when something happens, when you are continuing corrupt people, you must be politically blind. You could as well have a situation that even the looting that is going on now, there are collaborators who are not members of NPP. The one who can and say that it's only NPP people who are free. Let's see them. What about if they are collaborated even within your 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 your, your own party? Who help the looting to happen? What do you do? Cover them up and go and jail them. Their thief must be punished and our thief must be protected. So we must be serious about the fight against corruption. You know why President Rollins did legitimacy early in the case of the revolution? There was a very sad incident when people were, you know, queuing for essential commodities and so on. There was a sad incident where a relative of President Rollins who was wielding a weapon, fired, and a certain woman lost her life. When that relative was arranged before court, the judges were all afraid. So they acquitted and discharged him. When there are evidence, eyewitnesses. So President Rowling used the state authority to send the matter to appeal and quoting that justice must take place. The next court found its relative guilty and sentenced him for, uh, sentenced him to death. He signed the warrant and his relative was shot. He paid for the, uh, the things that he had committed. That singular act, however unfortunate it was, this 
sent one strong message in the heads of every Benin that look, this man is a man of justice. If he can do, he can exact accountability for his own family member, then trust me, he won't say any other person who, who does something wrong. That was one of the early incidents that established the legitimacy of President Rollins' speeches. So, if you are in government, you must see yourself as, uh, you know, a family member of the whole country, not your biological family, and seek to treat people exactly the same uh, accountability demands on everybody equally who misapplies his purpose. That is the way we can move this country away from where we are, from the trenches where we are now, and put it on the roof of gold. So anybody who is in MCC now and is in government would have nothing to fear if they have not messed up any state resources. They will be entitled to live their life in peace without harassment and then contribute to their quota. Hmm. We will take their advice when it is found to be useful so that we can all build a nation together. But those who have misapplied state property, there is nowhere for them to hide. That property must be accounted for. So if you don't want to go, even before the election, try and vomit whatever you have stolen, and then pay yourself. Because there's accountability going to happen. Gee. But do you find that the cause for the appointees of this government to be held accountable are louder than they've ever been when it, when uh, the tenure of other governments were ending? No, the calls are not Titia sitting here and the casting in name, mono, the casting in name, mono, or bonum was a yes, Sika who drank of we a year, Sika who drank of we as a sa or mon fire the papa beer and more minor a quack way a papa for one pipi mo crampo as a sa I ain't papa bonny for because Sisino o and pipi mo a dinny a day a doubt Intino moko position po na se omochiro ode o se ode omai no ye de da wa koma so intino umfa hwe na moko position sanso npp ni intino asama gana ni be ka che o se oko position na se hia wa na so ho che wa o ye papa na wa nwie sika ni bi no asama o me ka che o se so that is our jj ta eye imfc ka mo jj kono amo bo gana fo nyina sto na honda so che inti ama papa for mo e ye part ni mo crampo no asha se e wiya asha se e se sesken because e ye omo first kana na omo leader da o mano president a o da gana nyina no e se ko he se bibia e ko na akwa bibia da na akwa mo sa president no e ba be clear o inti we ye minister we ye ho ahon appoint na se obie di kan afa bi na president abe clear no e fight ma no ade na wa fa no na se o so te wo ehia wo de wo se o man ne de wa koma so inti no de e ko so no nye bia wo ko position ko medde o papa because already na bu fo abe se gana fo mu enya ade se gana ni bia abe hwe o ama abusia se won ko chi o position inti ama adwem bone abe se e ye san ko fo nyina mu na mo de o ma hu mu nyina mo mo luti no mo se 
ama gana fwa mwa chira mo gana fwa e su na se stwa nana mwa mwa nti yon mwa jen wwa e breaking the eight yon mwa jen wwa e election because at that time no yon mwa strategy ba kone se mwa edin yon mwa ji jiska ama mwa fwa edi enye bise de ba elections bi yon mwa kwe no when en e stati se ba election na se kwa election yon mwa ji jiska ne ama fwa yon de en tuwa ba ma yon it's not like yon chre e nye ma yon ye na mwa yon shwa sun tu ma yon it's not like yen share economy ni se di amount for yen ejuma ye ni amount to say more inflation to say yen no amu di si yen cheska si a strategy kamu strategy yen wajis amu yuye si ka a pali yu guwa ama gana for yen de eh chom nan di o a shwa gana for yen yen ase se di mahama se di professor jena no po kwa jima yen ah amu yin na ye li da ewe yen di si amu babo yen beka mi yin sa agro na mu di yo amu ba me chiche amu yin na Hane pese di misi kwa komen sa chine dropi komenti. Se di ketia na kasta no. A wache se. E ni braba. Na. Omo di yoma e redi. Se. Be bie skani bi afe bi ano. Ombe di yoma di yama gana fo. Na omo ti mdi yoma ni ye. Subscribe ni shema ye. Doma.